Welcome to Softy Demi. Today I come up with my new lecture. In this lecture, the content name is Work Products and Documents. Work Products and Documents. How to manage work products and document in Primavera P6 Professional. How you can assign your professional documents to your Primavera P6 to each activity by assigning times, approvals, and dates in your Primavera P6. Here my Primavera P6 is open in the bottom. You can see here right here. So from the right, from the leftmost corner, you can see there is a document button. You can see I zoom here, WPS and document. Work products and documents. Work products and documents here i open when i open work products and documents you can see a window will be display in front of you so what i will do i will add from insert button or add from this so the easy button is insert and here i add a document you can see there is a new document added here so you can so go for the columns and there is default column and you can customize your columns in this document from general you can go there and general you can assign author of the document deliverable deliverable you can add here deliverable you need location public relation location i will show you what is public and what is private location and you can also assign a project here so you can also assign a version here this most important version here if you have any user defined you can also assign here a user define here you can assign a revision date also i will press ok apply ok my first document i have to add here okay, my first document i have to add here is it's my deliverable non objection document Communication documents, management, plan procedure. I have added my first document, communication, communications document management plan and procedure. So I will add here the reference. It's my first documents. I will add what's your reference and what's your project name. I will add anything what I have. So here you can write reference number of your document and here you Type status. I will add here in progress and document category. Here you can see document categories. There are categories written here under your documents. You can display here your all the categories. Category templates, bid document, general document, regulatory document. Here all the documents are written here. So I will cross here and I will go for admin, admin, admin categorize. Here you can see it admin categorize. From here you can see here document categories. You can add here a category. I will add here non objection. I have added non objection. And I will add for information for information i have added two categories documents for non objection and for information i have added two documents for non objection and for information i will close here and i will assign this document as a non objection this document have to submit necessary here you can see non for non objection. So it will non objection deliverable. You have to assign deliverable revision date. You can assign here date, any date, revision date, 27 of February. You can assign here. In the bottom, you can see there is a layout. You can write author name, any, any author name, Mr. John is making this document. You have, you have to write here Mr. John. 
you can add the column of auto author from here right click and go for column description you can also add description column here modify document what is the description of document here right the document importance what the document consists of right here in the description and the file you can go here in the file so you cannot need any uh, directly go to file in the excel we we have hyperlinks and other micros you can go directly to the, to the files so here i will go for my document it's in private location and desktop and it's private location private location means in my system here i find my file documents and here is my 001 file communication document management plan procedure from here launch i can launch my document from here you can see easily i have launched my document from here after i added in the document and also from public public location you can also add here from public relation you and also you can add a public location like you can if you save your file in google drive or any other drives or spaces media file you have yandisk any any files any location where is a shareable links you can add your shareable link in the public location and you can launch from here assignments if you have any assignment given this activity assign this activity assign it an activity here you can assign activity here drag this any activity mobilization issuance of drawing yes mobilization of contractor you can assign this one and you can also cross and assign you can also assign a wbs to this one yeah you can see wbs or a mobilization contractor i will add both one and i will show you the both locations here you go for activities and from here you can see right click there and customize activity here wps and move this to last one air open wps work product and documents you can see in for non objection this document is under from its category and this one is document name here in the bottom and the status code is in progress so you can also see here from wps you go to wps and also wps work products document you can also do there and go for there you can check from work breakdown structure also documents so i remove these documents from here and also you can customize your user defined fields here so i will add my all documents here and show you how to group and sort into different categories So here I have created my all documents. You can assign the revision dates from here. If there is twenty seven, twenty eight, so on. Here, twenty eight February. So you can say here, in progress. You can write on hold, or under review, or approved. you can say here not started on hold in progress completed and here you can see approved so here i write my status different status and different for information you can write some documents as for for information i will just show you the group and sort of this one right click here and group and sort 
you can also sort this one by status not started not reviewed completed on hold and approved you can show by status here and you go go here and group and sort by category here these are non objection and for this is for information here and you can also filter your all and you can also see here filter your deliverable filters and group and sort option you can use very well here you can also use this one collapse option so here you can see list here and filter by all documents here and i can see group and sort by status also here so i want to show just your status and you can assign this one documents and location from your system you can see here version you can change version 3 4 what you have how to create document categories i have shown you from admin categories and how to assign the status and how to create references number statistics of projects so here you can go for activities here and for activities you can add a column of column of so here you can go for activities and here you can add a column of wps and docs work products and documents you can add document here from here you can go there and you can add document here and in wps same here add a add a column here and assign documents to the wps work breakdown structure and activities so this is the end of my lecture please comment subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to all to get my latest upcoming notification on your email and on your channel